Now, over the weekend, the Lagos Film House was abuzz with excitement and Nigerian stars arrived in style for the premiere of the American action comedy film Bad Boys Ride or Die. The Black Carpet event saw celebrities donning Shap's signature Bad Boy outfits. Now, Bad Boys Ride or Die, the fourth installment in the Bad Boys series star, will feature Will Smith and La Martin Lawrence. The film follows Miami detective Mike Laurie and Marcus Brunner as they attempt to clear their name of their late captain, Connell Howard, who has been falsely accused of conspiracy. Now, the Bad Boys are back and this time is a matter of life or death. Superb. I think um, it's um, it's valuable and it's very um, it's efficient as well because I think it's it's bringing a lot of money. You know? And uh, I think it's it's been fun since '96, and they still have the courage to do another one. It's to let you know that it's a potent project. Of course, why not? With the right budget, we're already doing stuff. But there's something we all need to understand. Every geopolitical zone would have to do their own thing. We don't need to chase or be in another man's race. No, we don't have to. They are doing things synonymous to their own environment, their own um, social and political um, ideologies and all of that. So we have to do our own thing. That will make us look like what they are doing. We don't have to typically directly do what they do. You understand? So uh, I don't want to do a compare and contrast thing. The only thing we need to know that is uh, the, the, the two industries are doing really well for themselves. Like I said, with the right budget, with our own type of story, we're on a global stage already. Okay, so the thing is that uh, Bad, Boy move, uh, Bad Boy franchise is about the bad boys to the bad people. It's the good people for us, but bad boys to the bad people. So it's also about uh, a movie that brings in family, that brings in crime, that brings in the police force that brings in trust, that brings in love, and brings in uh, uh, retribution uh, at no cost. So they, they, they don't care about what they destroy. So, and then it brings in a lot of humor. The humor from Martin Lawrence, from uh, Fresh Prince, is always crazy. And it also gives you an insight into the crime rate and, and the fact that drugs are destroying the society and people will go to any extent. So, and so that story is consistent. And so from when they were first, the first uh, uh, installment to all the other ones that they've done, the story has always been that uh, good always wins. From the, and the bad boys are the ones that make good win. So it's always a good story. And, and, but here, I'm here for humor. I'm here for the humor. Oh, by, by the way, I'm here to also see the, the progression of the technology where Steadicam is now used by the actors themselves, the way the, the Steadicam and carry on. It, it's really, I need to see uh, the directorial approach. I need to see uh, the treatment of the script um, and have a good laugh. Have a good laugh. Yeah. I'm not tired. Why? I, I would say I'm not tired because um, Bad Boy is always filled with a lot of action and quirkiness, like comedy. You get my point? So it's enjoyable. You just want to keep seeing it, you want to keep going to see it's just like a lot of movies that I've seen like four different parts, so I mean I'm not mad at Bad Boys, I feel like it's going to be so thrilling I'm looking forward to it Bad Boys, Bad Boys, what you gonna do what you gonna do when they come for you